Thank you for coming to the kickoff celebration for the new Electric City Purple Route that will provide service to Belton and Pania Path and the extension of the Gold Route to several employers on Masters Boulevard. This pilot project will allow folks in new service areas to look for new employment opportunities, retain their current positions, and gain access to education and training. It will also provide people in other parts of Anderson County the ability to seek opportunity in parts of the community that may have previously been off limits due to the lack of transportation. In 2001, we started out with the cat bus and then we went from the cat bus to the Homeland Park area. And now here we are, we, uh, we're rolling out again. This is a vital handout to many citizens seeking educational training and cultural opportunities and a greater variety of job opportunities. The city of Anderson, we've been in the transportation business since 1989 and our ridership has quadrupled in the last few years and, and without the partnerships of county, uh, WorkLink, and other entities, things like this just don't happen. Uh, and it also gives the opportunity for people who would not have transportation otherwise to get jobs, to, you know, to go to the doctors, to, to do shopping and all those kinds of things. It just gives a quality of life to a segment of folks that otherwise would have none. And again, to point out that this route is going to Belt and Honeyapath, Path, but it's also going to First Quality and Electrolux and all of those plants down there, which is huge because of the success the county's had and the city's had. We have a lot of people. Those companies need people to work, and hopefully this will open up a whole new avenue for those people to get to work. Kempton needs people to work. Everybody needs people to work. We need to get those people to where the jobs are. So it's going to make a nice circle around and it's going to involve, in, in my understanding, over 23 industries and businesses along that route. Our other route is an extension of our goal route, which is the Homeland Park route. Load up. Let's go for a bus ride. Yeah, Old McCann's is the uh, transfer point. So that's where all the buses meet up first thing in the morning. They meet there every hour. Yeah, this bus is one of the city's newest buses. This is a, a compressed natural gas bus. We were able to purchase those last year uh, because we had a uh, had been meeting with Piedmont Natural Gas for over two years. So Piedmont Natural Gas built the station out beside the Sphinx on 28 Bypass. And uh, by doing that, uh, gave us the infrastructure to be able to go to an alternative fuel vehicle. Uh, we think that's important for our community because of air quality and, you know, especially in the upstate, our, you know, carbon footprint is pretty high. So uh, to make sure our air quality is as good as it can be, uh, we're just trying to do our part.